jubilation. Peter Obi's victory in Lagos gives the governorship aspirant an upper hand. Soon be declared winner. Wow. Everybody knew that. Everybody knew that that uh, Peter Obi has really paved way for uh, for the Labour Party um, gubernatorial aspirants. He has really paved a way for him to win, and that is why you saw that the um, the threats started coming so early, early that the APC started, you know threatening fire and ice early this morning very early as early as eight seven in fact you know because these uh these INEC officials they came out early so these um, talks have to take advantage of the polling unit so those people that actually came out early to vote uh, to vote when they saw that uh that uh For uh, for Labour Party, they whip them, they beat them, or they send them back home. You see that. So these are the things that they were so doing, and um, it it became so 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 rowdy, and uh, led to a very serious violence. Still on that, the young man is still recording um, victory. Um, according to the correspondence out there, he has said it that. Uh, uh, very soon we'll hear the, the the bomb the bomb record the bomb results <laughs> that's how i put it that that the young man is making an a hmm. does it mean that uh, 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 the incumbent governor uh, the incumbent governor is not going to 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 be the is not is not going to 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 win or it's not coming out it's not coming back again hmm. that is uh, another very big question for us to answer okay let's quickly check the contents my dear listeners this is evening news by now it is obvious to many political observers that the victory of the candidates on the labor party lp in the february 25th presidential election peter obi in Lagos State significantly altered the dynamic in the state's governorship election politics. Obi's victory over the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, APC Bola Ahmed Tunubu, a former governor of the state and a man widely regarded as the godfather of Lagos politics, has bolstered the opposition making it believe that it could defeat the incumbent APC governor, Babajide Sonwolu, in the Saturday March 18 gubernatorial election. It is for this reason that the political stock of the candidates of the LP in the state, Badibo Rhodes, Vivo alias GRV, has experienced an unprecedented meteoric rise in the days leading to the election. Interestingly, Rhodes Vivo's propulsion into political prominence catapulated by what I call the OB effect has eclipsed the popularity of the candidate of the People Democratic Party, PDP, Dr. Abdul Aziz Olajide Adediron, a.k.a. Jendor, who until a few weeks ago was widely seen as Somolu's main challenger. A few factors are responsible for this new reality. Smarting from obese loss of the presidential election to Tunubu in very controversial circumstances, his supporters known as the obedient have pulling and spoiling for vengeance as they seek to pay back Tunubu by snatching Lagos away from his grip. They have been mobilizing massively for Rhodes Vivo as they did for Obi. This has catapulted him to the pole position as the incumbent governor's main challenger. Today, he is the one with the most realistic chances of defeating the governor. He is the one that the leadership of the APC in the state is losing sleep over. <laughs> Hey, no be smart thing. Yes, so um it cannot it can 
It can't, it can't just be APC alone. At least, at least another party should come and rule. Another person should come and rule. Um, it will even all go well if another party comes comes in there. I was telling someone that it will be sweeter if someone else come in there and um and be the governor of of the state instead of uh, APC APC, so that um others from Tunubu will not just be carried out like that. You see, these criminals who call themselves thugs will go in because this guy. This this new party will not give room to this nonsense. You understand? Tunubu will be in the federal. Why did we in the states? You get it. So it will it be part. It's going to be, go well. But that is if we can understand things in that way. If you can understand things in that way, that is how I feel, and that is why what I feel. I don't know how you feel about this, but that is the reality. Okay, so a lot of persons are still wondering, saying, "What am I saying?" But what I'm, what I'm just saying is just the reality. Okay, so you take it or leave it. This guy, Badibo, you know, the LP guy, is making a wave. Let's quickly uh, hear from you from the outside. Let's know what your own opinion and what your own thoughts of what has just been revealed concerning this. Um, gubernatorial election and what is truly happening out there the reality is what we want to hear okay so don't forget to leave your comments below the comment section click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos thank you